There was once a time when a helicopter flying over Marquette would be a rare sight, but now it's almost a daily occurrence as Duke LifePoint contracts with Valley Med Flight to rush critically ill patients from outlying areas of the UP to the former Marquette General Hospital. American Heart Month is only days away, and now rural UP heart attack victims have a better chance of surviving thanks to the chopper and coordination between those on the front line and the medical teams like the cath lab at UP Health System Marquette. Greg Peterson has the third part of his series on Marquette changing medical community. This helicopter is launched as soon as a heart attack or trauma victim is reported in a remote area of the Upper Peninsula. It's a fast, coordinated effort between law enforcement, first responders, and hospitals. You know, as the helicopter now has moved to its final location right over on college, it's sitting there now where we have a helipad right on campus. We know that that was great. And, you know, we're, we average about 18 to 20 flights a month, which are really saving lives. Because the sooner you can get to a, a higher level of care, the better chance that you're going to have less uh, permanent injury. So the helicopter has, has been a wonderful uh, addition to the UP in getting people who don't live close to Marquette able to get to Marquette quickly. Time is tissue when it comes to heart muscle. That's the message from the UP Health System cath lab in Marquette. It means officials had to set up a network that allows for the quickest arrival on the scene and then to Marquette. In late December, Valley Med Flight Chopper 1 was called to a snowmobile accident in Alger County. This is the video of the helicopter thanks to Alger County Sheriff Robert Hughes and his department. Within minutes, that chopper is Marquette bound. And just as in the case of heart attack victims, the paramedics on this flight kept the ER and others updated with the latest stats on the patient's vitals. Uh, patient had a lot of on scene, uh, approximately five to seven minutes. The patient at this time is uh, awake or oriented, complaining of uh, left shoulder pain and back and neck pain. Quite of the table left at a uh, vital 135 over 61. The paramedics on the flight keep the ER and others updated with the patient's vital signs and other medical info. While that chopper is en route to the scene, the proper doctors, staff, and departments are notified that either a heart attack or a trauma victim will be inbound shortly. Instead of better outcomes, officials would still rather you prevent a heart attack. Plus, during heart month, make sure you know the signs of a heart attack so you know it's not just indigestion. The UPHS Marquette landing pad has become a popular spot. It's, it's interesting to see because now when the helicopter lands, most people who are walking on the street pull out their iPhone and video it. However, if you watch that chopper arrive, be careful as the rotors plus winter winds make for a freezing experience. Thawing out along the Marquette helicopter pad for ABC 10 CW5, I'm Greg Peterson.